Hey guys, this is Vril, continuing our EU4 Fallout mod playthrough as the Caesar's Legion. So for me, it's been a couple weeks since I last recorded an episode, because I recorded a few episodes extra because I was knew I was building a new computer, so some of our settings have changed, and if you guys have any questions or comments about the quality here, something that needs to be changed, it should all be a whole lot better than it was before. I've got a little bit better... Uh, equipment now going on and uh, but let me know if if you have any comments about it so we've also had an update to this mod and one of the big changes was they're no longer called the Caesar's Legion they're just called the Legion so that's uh, something to note so I'm not sure why they did that but that's what the author decided to do now we did take over quite a bit of chunk of NCR here and We've had some comments about New Vegas is growing large here. I think they've set us as a rival, so we're going to have to take care of them here shortly. And we'll go ahead and do that. I've got, we just took over quite a few provinces from the NCR, and we've got a lot of unrest over there, and we also need to make some cores. So I'm going to go ahead and start doing that. Like I said, we do have some unrest. We do have some diplomatic, too many dip diplomatic relations. Uh, we'll take care of that. Look at all this unrest that we have to deal with. That might become a problem. We've got a bunch of truces. Uh, we're not going to do any more missions. I don't think I have enough money to really do that. And we've actually been doing a bunch of claims over here on New Vegas as well. So we've got an open diplomat. Let's see if we can do any more fabrication of claims. Okay, we were already doing one. That That uh, is good to note. So... One of the things we should probably do to get rid of those diplomatic relations is improve our relations so we can go ahead and annex one of our vassals here. So... They need to be 190 opinion with us. We have to probably... Let's see where they at here. Improve relations plus 70. We might need to spend some money on some bottle caps on improving the relations with them, but I think for now I'm thinking to just build some forces so that we can prepare for taking over New Vegas. We've actually got we're down to 54, and I know it was kind of a bad idea, but I sent sent about, I don't know, 10 guys to explore with my adventurer here so i'd probably way too many guys with that adventure if they decide to come back I'll, I'll take them back so let's go ahead and just start building some more legion some legionnaires and we'll build these aren't too expensive so let's just build until we get to our cap so we can actually build 22 i might not build that many i don't want to run out of money here Let's go down to, we're going to build 18 sounds like a good number, and we were fabricating, not fabricating claims while we're doing that too, but we were coring some provinces, not going to build any improvements, I don't really care about those, let's see what we can do about these Californian separatists here, if we do harsh treatment, that would kind of cost a lot of military power, except demand, certainly not going to do that. Let's think about, okay, yeah, I think we're going to have to reduce that by spending military power. And who was the other one that we were going to deal with? Okay, these are the ghouls, so I think that's okay for now. Do have war exhaustion, that's something to keep in mind. Pretty good, yeah, so we're over, have high overextension. I'm just going to start progressing time here since we're... Spending too much time talking about this and need to spend some time actually progressing time, so. Actually, I'll move. Start moving some of our forces kind of into position here to take on New Vegas. So we did start to fabricate some claims here, and we're fabricating. Not, not sure which one. What are we doing here? Hidden Valley, so. Grateful natives have risen up. This is uh, because we're, I think we're colonizing. Is that what we're doing? Yes, we are colonizing that province. Like I said, it's been, uh, I don't know, a couple weeks since I last recorded an episode of this particular playthrough. Just getting everything set up with my new computer and dealing with all that. 
so I'm kind of uh, refreshing myself. I did watch a little bit of the last episode just to keep in mind what we were doing here. Got so many things going on that it's hard to remember sometimes what we were actually doing. All right, so this is, let's check on our supply limits actually pretty good there. Not taking attrition or anything. Okay, and our manpower is pretty good these days as well. Let's check on the force limit for the, and uh, not NCR, New Vegas. So 39,000. NCR is only New Vegas. Okay, they do have manpower, so keeping that in mind. They're actually over their force limit, interestingly enough. So let's see, as we get our administrative power up, let's go ahead and just start spending that on coring over here. Oh, what this is here, and I'm not sure why that's suddenly appearing. Okay, oh, we're taking some attrition here, so let's go ahead and split this up. Yeah, that's not good. What was our situation with our military leaders here? Okay, so we do have Ashton Foster and Noah Lee. And it's unfortunate we're wasting a little bit of our... Getting some attrition there. Okay, so the Ungrateful Natives have risen up again. That's about the only place that the natives are rising up right now. So I'm thinking once we... Okay, our colony here is self-sustaining. We do have two. I was thinking for a moment we have only one colonist, but that for the longest time we only had one colonist. Now we do have two. So let's actually go ahead and send this one to Roswell. Okay. So we're all good here. Let's move this group to protect what's going on in Roswell. Make another core. I guess Daglo was probably one of the provinces that we took that maybe we didn't have a, a claim on, so that's going to cost a little bit more, I think. So we've got some diplomats that we should probably use. Let's look at our opinions. So Good Springs is 188. Let's see, I don't think that we can really vassalize them, but we'll. Go ahead and see if we can improve that to the maximum and see if they will accept it. Okay, let's actually double check what we could in terms of fabricating a claim here. We've only got the eastern outskirts, or southern outskirts, and the uh, northern outskirts. We already had some of these, but... Okay, I'm actually not going to do that at the moment. Let's see, what else can we do? I'm thinking to improve our relations with the... with the Midwestern chapter over here. Now, one thing I was going to mention, I don't think I did mention, is that... we have this mission for the glory of Rome. This is our ultimate goal for this... for this playthrough. Once I achieve this, I think I'll end the playthrough at that point. So it's the glory of Rome, and that's to, to eliminate the NCR and to own New Vegas. So that would be good. We did talk about what the forming the Empire of the Legion. Somebody asked about that. It's a number of cities, at least 100, so we're not there yet either. So I would guess that once that happens, we'd be called the Empire of the Legion rather than just the Legion, which... I'm still going to call this the Caesar's Legion. I prefer it to be called that way, so it's more interesting to me. Okay, let's see what our adventurer is off over here doing. Okay, he's actually not doing... He's automated to explore. Is he not doing any of that? Maybe we just bring him back home. Yeah, he's going to... It's a good route to come back home, probably explore into maybe into Chicago even. Okay. 
So, one more core to go here. Okay, so we have found another pre-war lab. Let's see, we do, we'll spend that on the administra- or get the administrative power, because we're using that, and we'll go ahead and make that uh, Dayglow also a core. So we might finally manage to convert the heretics of Boulder City, and we have another colony here. Separatists have risen up, okay. How many separatists? Actually, that's a two-star general there, so, and here as well. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with this. Let's see here, I don't know where are these guys all at. So this guy's Noah Lee, let's put Ashton Foster on here. Okay. So that's Army of Good Springs. I don't know why they're there. I guess maybe they're helping us out. Okay, we've got a another missionary we can send. I'm actually going to... We've got some fervor that we can use. I'm going to do that on stability. So that'll make it go down. We'll probably won't be able to use it after a while. So we can invest in new technology. I'm going to hold off on that for a moment to probably... See if we can... Now we don't need to use it any anymore. Okay, yeah, we're not accepting any demands. That's, that's for certain. Okay, so we've improved our relations with the... Good Springs. So let's recall that diplomat and see if there's any chance that we could... Offer vassalization. No. It's very close, though. Yeah, it's unfortunate, so... What about here? We probably... Not at 190. What else could we improve our relations with Jacobstown? We've already done all that. Probably go on over to New Reno again and improve our relations with them a little bit. What else do we have here? Invest in technology. We're not going to do that at the moment. We are suffering casualties, too many diplomatic relations everything we know about. Okay. That province, so that was... Got another colonist there, so recall this diplomat. We've got more separatists. Oh no, that's just the same separatists, but they sieged out those areas. So I, we might actually not end up declaring war on the whole New Vegas in this episode. We'll see what happens though. Let's uh, go ahead and send these guys to here. And okay, so we already have that. Let's, let's move these guys here and have these guys come up here to deal with the, the natives if they happen to rise up. I'll be curious how our army handles this two-star general here. I think he'll be completely fine, but We'll see what happens. I think our military tech is quite a bit higher than anybody else's, so we should be completely fine. I'm going to split this army so we can siege these both out, get them back as quick as possible. So actually, we do have this navy here that could probably hunt pirates. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, we took one of those back, and we'll send these guys back up to Nipton, and the other guy will send up to Prim when he's done. Okay, took those back from our rebels. Got a bunch of cores still being, cores being cored. Rebel factions, colonies, navies. Let's go ahead and put our better general, better leader on this guy. And probably do one on this guy over here. Maybe this one. Okay. So once we're done, okay, we got one more to core. That's uh, one of our new colonies is what that was. 
These colonies are going a whole lot quicker than we were than they were going before, now that we took some of that where are these guys at? Just out of curiosity. Yeah, we've got the pit over here, okay. What was over here? We've got Richmond, we've got Paradise Falls. Can't tell what that one is. We've got yeah, that's all the pit. Interesting. So this might be... Okay, Bunker Alpha. That's probably the capital of the Midwestern chapter. Okay, well... I think we're probably ready to go ahead and declare that war I was mentioning. Kind of at the end of the episode, but... Okay, so we have our truce with MODOK ended. NCR, everybody's ended here. Let's just have a look at NCR before we do anything. Let's look at, I guess we're going to have the, the pit will be on there as well. So the pit actually is all the way up to 31,000. New Vegas, 44,000. They're 9,000 over their limit. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll go ahead and declare war on New Vegas. And I think once we, if we can win this war, obviously we will, I think it'll kind of put us in a good situation where they probably won't be able to recover for a little while. So we're going to take, again, all of these areas that we had claimed, if we can. I think that's going to take us all the, all the way almost to 100% war score to actually need to get that. But let's uh, do the Repcon test site. Okay. So we'll start flooding over the border here. Now I do think they'll probably have a large stack somewhere, so... Yeah, there's 2016. Okay, um, so we've gained the Cass's Belly against NCR. New uh, Good Springs is going to help them out here. So that's slightly worrying, but we'll be okay. Let me double check my subjects are actually going to do something. It's the wrong screen here. So military focus will be aggressive. So yeah, they do have 44. Might be a good idea if we can just merge all these guys, take out this large stack. Yeah, I think that'd be the best idea. There's nobody else around to help out. Talking about all my own troops. So radioactive waste. Some options here. We'll process the waste. Okay, we'll merge all these guys up. And actually, let's go ahead and merge them up in these southern outskirts. Although, we need do need to set a leader of this before before we're in enemy territory. Okay, we're going to take some attrition here. But I think we'll be okay if we just go ahead and attack this and take out the large bulk of their army. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. We're going to take some pretty heavy losses here, but yeah, actually, okay, yeah, we won that. Okay, let's go ahead and take these guys and Good Springs. Okay, they're gonna move. It's actually let's see if we can take this group out. They're gonna move before we get there. It looks like uh, New Reno over here is helping out. going to try to grab these guys and take out a pretty, put them on the full defensive in this war and then we'll just focus on sieging out. Okay, yeah, we took that up to 7%. I'm just going to check. It's interesting that Good Springs didn't help us out on this whole deal. Just going to check what kind of war score this would take. Okay, we can actually click on all these, so... That's not what we want. 
Am I talking to the, we're talking to Good Springs, that's not what I want. I want to talk to New Vegas. Okay, so... Just checking the ones that aren't going to cost us anything. Just checking, okay, so it will be up to Peace Offer Value is 92, so that's going to take us a little while to get to. We're going to have to do a lot of sieging to get to that point. But I think we're at the point here where we can let me move this army to here. We'll win that and we'll go ahead and split this stack and start doing a little bit of sieging. And we'll take, if we see a stack roaming around, we'll try to take it out as well. Got another province that we can, we've got a lot of provinces that are secular that we'll go ahead and try to convert over to the Cult of Mars. But it does look like we're out of time for this episode, so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.